Welcome back to my channel. Okay, so today's video is an exciting one. This is a Beast Mode Fragrances. This is in collaboration with Miss Moon Perfume. She is an amazing, kindest, supportive person that I've met through YouTube. I really, really enjoy having her as a friend. So I'm just gonna tell you about what I have. So the two that I already decluttered, Beast Mode Fragrances, is number one, Shug of Oud. It's Rose Oud Perline Beast Mode, and that's the reason why I declutter it, because as soon as I spray it, it takes over the mood the entire day. The, the smell literally lingers in the room forever. And once I get it on my skin, unless if I go take a shower and literally scrub it off, it won't take off. And that's the reason why I declutter it. Even though it smells wonderful and it's a do for Lancome Oud Bouquet. So that's my number one. Number two is, or is also what I decluttered. This is Tom Ford Black Orchid. It's actually really beautiful, dark, mysterious kitchen sink perfume. It has like chocolate, um, truffles. It's it's beautiful. I actually take a decan. It's it's actually really, really nice. If you're looking for something beast mode for fall, I do like it. I live in a hot and humid Texas where it's cold literally like one month a year so i can't justify keeping it so i did take a decan of it um and to me that's enough oh i'll be going to work today well actually i'll be going to lunch to pick up the hardware um for work this is actually the first time i'm going to work work for me it's like about an hour drive it's quite long so i might take you guys with me but i don't think i'm going to work i'm just gonna meet up with the friend at um lunch for lunch and i could pick up the hardware angel muse this is beautiful chocolate patchouli feta fur i don't like patchouli but this one still um, stays in my collection actually you know what i think i might like patchouli when it's paired with the dark um, chocolatey earthy stuff but I can't stand patchouli when it's with sweet scent or when it's with like fruit because then it smells like a dirty fruit or rotten fruit alien moogler beautiful jasmine amber and woody notes this is a, such a beautiful scent when you spray it on it'll like last for the entire day um, another one that's beast mode is Hypnotic Poison by Dior. Almondy, uh, sensual, it has like tuberose, it has plum, it has sandalwood. It's just a warm blankety scent. It's just like beast mode and I love wearing it during winter. Um, another one that's beast mode is All Harame Juno Noir. This one smells like a uh, powdered sugared kumquat fruit with vanilla powdery it's really nice you guys i highly highly recommend it and it's super duper affordable i love it the most beast mode of all in my perfume collection well actually i do have a lot of beast mode hold on one more um dior addict oh my god super duper beast mode it's super powdery, it's super mysterious, it's super dark, it is white floral, it's really heady. Alright, so another beast mode scent. Tom Ford Jasmine Rouge. This one to me is beast mode. I've tested it once and this is such a beautiful dried jasmine. Mm, this is sweet jasmine, really, really beautiful. I have mine from Royalty Scent. If you don't have a subscription service, this is actually a really good way and an affordable way to try out different scents. And they have been different um, options and I would recommend to try out the expensive one, you know. Oh, this is so beautiful. So I picked up this month royalty scent. Oh, while we're at it, let me talk about it. This month I actually picked Tom Ford Jasmine Rouge. It's just like beautiful jasmine. Oh my goodness, it's so good. This is really, really dry jasmine. It's really sweet. I really, really enjoy it. 
Um, but it is expensive though, and I do love my Alien or Sublime. And Tom Ford Jasmine, which is just, it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Jasmine. I don't know, I might consider picking that one up, but another royalty scent. This is also another beast mode, Lancome La Nuit Tresor, and I picked the Ala Voli. This one is really nice, you guys. This one's like Tonka, Benzoin, Vanilla. It's really, really sweet. Actually, let me try it. Let me try it. Oh my goodness. It's Tonka. It's sweet. It's really, really pleasant. I really, really enjoy it. I'm thinking of like picking up a full bottle of this. This is just so beautiful. Oh, so good. Yep, so these are the two royalty scents that I picked. Um, Jasmine Rouge and La Nuit Tresor a la Folie. I enjoy both and maybe I should just finish them up before picking up full bottle, but I do love those two. This month pick is amazing, it's good. And the most beast mode of all my perfume in my entire collection and i'm not sure if this one's staying in my perfume collection just because this one's such a beast mode but i do enjoy it this is lancome roses berberanza this smells like rose and pistachio some people say that it smells like feet i don't smell the feet i just smell like a super strong rose and like literally pistachio actually enjoy it. Rose is not my thing. It's not my preferred flower. Now that I decluttered, I come to realize that. In fact, I think I have the most orange blossom and tuberose. So those are my two favorites. And even actually only own two or three jasmine. Um, yeah. So surprise, surprise. Roses Veranza. This is like a beast mode. Oh, I also have Delina exclusive. That one's also a beast mode. Uh, like, you know, those thick syrups, sweet rose in the baklava, inside the baklava, but no nuts, just the uh, syrup inside the baklava um, at Mediterranean dessert. And plus like nutmeg ice cream on the side. It's just beautiful. Oh, another beast mode, like any Mancera's beast mode. Um, Roses vanille is beast mode. I love that one. I will take you guys with me throughout the day. I might take, I might put on um, eyelashes. I don't know. This is real life, guys. All right, guys. So my scent of the day, it's kind of cold outside. It's about 60s. Um, I should put my phone here. <laughs> so I still film with my phone, by the way. Yeah, so scent of the day is Angel Muse. I love this so much. Oh, it's been a while since I wear my Angel Muse. Mmm, patchouli! <laughs> but I like it though. Do I like it? Yeah, I love it. Oh, so good. Alright, I'm gonna spray more on my hair. I know you shouldn't spray on your hair because it gets dry, but whatever. Oh, so good. So good. It's so good. This is so good. So good. I'm so glad I still have it because it has patchouli, so... Oh! Ooh, so good. All right. So, actually, I'm going to bring this with me because I like to spray myself throughout the entire day. So, ooh, I have this, like, pocket um, from my Ana Luisa jewelry that I'm using currently. You can see. Not sponsored, not sponsored. And it came with this little pouch. And I like to put my small perfume with me. All right, I'll take you guys with me. Now we're gonna go to Kinko's to print and I'm gonna go USPS. All right, so I'm pulling in Kinko's, like FedEx for printing. Um, wow, I am wearing Angel Muse. It's so good, you guys, it smells so delicious it's like oh my god why don't i wear this throughout the year and this is exactly why i declutter perfume so that i could wear what i really really enjoy and then now i get to enjoy those perfume that i used to love you know um yeah 
So I'm here at Kinko, so I'm gonna go in and print out the um <laughs> yeah, so now I'm gonna print out my packing slip for my the stuff that I sold, the girl on Shalimar Souffle and Tents. Uh, okay. Oh, I just went to USPS. I forgot to turn on the camera. All right, so I just dropped off my package. So now I am going to drive to a restaurant to meet up with my friend's last coworker so that I could pick up hardware for my test uh, for my work. All right, guys, so I'm here um, at the restaurant. I'm It was really delicious. So I'm gonna go to work. Turns out the hardware is not enough. I need to grab a couple more. So, so I'm here next to work. So I decided to stop by Bucky's because I used to come here all the time to get coffee. I think this might be the last time I'm in this office. So that's why I decided to stop by for a coffee. Yes. <laughs> 